Hi everyone and welcome to Mitch Rosin TV once again. Just uh, a little message for you all. I am sharing quite a few bits and pieces that I'm going to start doing individual exercises on Instagram as well as obviously my YouTube videos which will be the full length video. So um, I've thrown in a back workout and a little bit of biceps at the end on this video and I'm going to be throwing some hamstrings and shoulders up onto Instagram and explaining the exercise as well. So. And also, I'm doing a little video for muscle food, so there's going to be all my information on muscle food as well. So have a little look at that and check out muscle food because we've got some good codes coming in. We had a bit of a mess up um, a couple of weeks ago, so deeply apologise to everyone that got on the end of that. <clears throat> it was a mistake of a code, a misunderstanding, and uh, hopefully everyone's sorted out now. So um, hope you enjoy the video and uh, carry on what you're doing, sharing, liking, and um, following what I do. Thank you. Breakfast, so I've got 75 grams of oats. I've got some uh, two scoops of ISO um, protein in there, and then I'm going to put a scoop of whole loaf peanut butter. This one here I really like. I also use uh, Muscle Foods, which has added protein, and then I've got a coffee to go as well. So I'm off down the gym just to uh, do some back grip training. Got a bit of arms today, a little bit of back, so uh, nice day. So I'm going to walk down there and uh, have a nice little workout and keep you posted how it's going. So I've got my intro, I've had my breakfast, all carved up and ready to go. So. so this is just a barbell bicep curl using the extreme fat grips, which I really, really enjoy when I'm doing the old uh, barbell bicep curl. I'll uh, show you from a couple of different angles as well. Um, as you can see, I'm still in my off season. Um, obviously when I do trim up, I do look a lot bigger. I've had a lot of people saying that I don't look as big, but obviously I'm heavier at the moment, so I'm obviously covered in a bit of body fat and water, so once that starts stripping off, I uh, will look bigger. So it's uh, quite uh, deceiving when you uh, start dropping the weight off. Anyway, back to the training. So that's the bar, just going straight into a different angle there. Just so you can see, I'm trying to straight my arms all the way down, big squeeze at the top. And then we're going to go into, uh, so it's just sort of a little bit of flying around different exercises and stuff, a little bit of rear delts now. So this is sometimes I go into the gym and I just throw a workout what I fancy doing. Uh, not always am I structured because uh, I just feel I just like to do a all out workout. So uh, I'll give you a couple of different ideas that you can do little circuits. So this is just a rear delt. I've been working on my upper back. I find this a really, really nice movement. It also really fires the core up as well because you sort of stabilise yourself. Uh, obviously, the heavier you go, you will find your core to fire up a little bit more. So um, give it a go, and then I'm just super set. It's basically, it's quite a, a nice, fast circuit. I've added a couple of exercises in from a workout I've done previously as well, just to give you a breakdown and to change it up a little bit. So this is just like a, a, a cable row. I've used the V-bar which I really like. I also do this on the high rows as well. So uh, give this a go, give it a good stretch out. Then we go straight on to, now I've gone on the bench because I just sometimes find it a little bit easier for myself and I can get the bar quite low rather than the hitting the floor. Um, but to be honest with you, I just find that when I'm on that bench, I think it's just a psychological thing. I stabilize a lot better. So give that one a go. And then same again, it's, you can do this in the Smith machine as well and then also dumbbells. So all similar sort of movements. So give these a go and uh, see what you think works the best. So I like to have a variation. So we're gonna move on to the single arm dumbbells, which is, uh, as I said before, the previous exercise, you can do the bent overs with dumbbells, but I'm gonna do single arm dumbbells on this one. And then I'm gonna throw in some uh, assisted chins, and then we'll also do a machine pull down. So it's just giving you different variations of a pull down. So, and there you can see I just changed grip. So I'm using the extreme fat grips on that, which I try to use quite a lot on my back because I feel that it really fires my forearms up. And then um, we're gonna throw you into a tiny little bit of biceps. I sometimes just blast my biceps, whether it's a one exercise. So workout done. So thank you all for tuning in to Mitch Cousin TV. Mind how you grow and see you all soon. So here we are, down in uh, sunny Whitstable, the sun's gone in. Just uh, This is the day life of Mitch that uh, Mitch goes in a lot of people have been asking for. 
So I'm just down the coast, which I do try and get away a lot on the weekends. It's not far from where I live. So um, we're just at a nice fresh fish bar. So we're going to get some, get some nice fish, fresh fish. <laughs>